Hi again, YouTubers. This is another portion of my collection. It's actually the last part of my collection um, because I already have a overview of my lip glosses video uh, posted and I have an overview of my lipsticks um, that are already posted. So I'm not going to go through those again because they haven't really changed. Um, but this is my eye bases like paint pots, um, Urban Decay, things like that. So first I'm going to start with my paint pots. My absolute favorite must have is the uh, Painterly paint pot. It's a great neutral color and it's really really pretty um, and has a nice beigey pink undertone so it really blocks out any colors on your eyelid which is really nice. Um, I use this just about every day if you ever watch my description box um, and I didn't use it today as funny as that is but um, most days I grab for this. It's the first thing I grab for. And there's no shimmer to that one at all. Then I also have Soft Ochre. Soft Ochre is a little bit more of a yellow based version of the paint pot. Um, if you have more of a yellow undertone, Soft Ochre is going to be better for you. My next favorite, and I actually have this on today, is uh, Groundwork. Groundwork is a beautiful brown undertone with not much shimmer to it. and it's just a great base color. I really like it if you're doing any type of a brown eye. Um, then I have Fresco Rose. Fresco Rose was the first one I ever bought. It's a really pretty pink, almost a little bit of a plum undertone. Has a shimmer to it. Then I have Girl Friendly. Girl Friendly is a little bit more of a matte version of the same type of color. There's no, sh not as much, sh I don't think there's any shimmer to that one. So. That's a girl friendly. Then I have Perky. Perky is a peach undertone. Really, really pretty. Um, has a slight shimmer to it, but it's not like real shiny. It's like a groundwork type of shimmer to it. Um, then there's Rubenesque. Rubenesque is a very shiny um, golden peach color. And then let's see here. I have Quite natural. Now, quite natural, I use, and you can tell by looking at it, I use as an eyebrow filler. I love it. Um, I use this quite frequently, and it's really easy to use. Um, you don't have to worry about using a wax and all those different things. You can just use this on its own. Um, the next one is Constructionist. I think I'm saying that wrong. It's a really pretty bronze shimmer undertone. Very nice. Which, by the way, Quite Natural has no shimmer to it, so that's why it works great um, as an eyebrow as well. And then uh, this is Artifact. Artifact is a beautiful rose, like, burgundy undertone. Has some shimmer to it. Really pretty. I like that one a lot. And then I have Black Ground. And Black Ground is just that. It is a black paint pot. It's a little bit of a shimmer to it. Not a lot, though. It's not intrusive. Um, in my paint pot area, I also have a fluid line. I'm not a big fluid line fan, um, but I use this as a base, and it's Iris Eyes. It's a really pretty, like, purple-blue color. So, that is my paint pots. And then I have two NYX Jumbo Eye Pencils. I have them in Milk, which is a white, and French Fry, which is a gorgeous bronze-brown color. I also have a shade stick in Penny. Penny is a really pretty copper peach color. And uh, that just came back out with the Sugar Sweet collection. Then I have my Laura Mercier's um, Eye Basics in Wheat. This is a great neutral color. I love taking this one places with me. It's so easy to use. Um, then I have Too Faced Shadow Insurance, and this is just the basic shadow insurance. They now have locked down as well, but um, this one has no color to it. Um, and then there's Urban Decay Eyeshadow Primer Potion, so UDPP, Urban Decay Primer Potion is what a lot of people call it. I love the staying power of this, and I actually have it on today, but I hate the packaging, as most people do. And then my last eye base is I have the MAC Paint in the color Still Life. Still Life is very similar to Bear Study in the paints. Um, it's a, it's kind of like a paint painterly with a shimmer to it. So those are my eyeshadow bases. Um, if you have any questions on any of the products you saw here, please put a comment below and I'll get back to you as soon as possible. Thanks for watching guys and have a great day. Bye.